For almost four decades, Ricky Gervais has been in a relationship with his soulmate Jane Fallon, with the pair deciding to eschew marriage and parenthood in favor of their own shared path in life. Best known for his observational comedy and various successful sitcoms, Ricky has previously drawn inspiration from his love for Jane when penning his hit Netflix series Afterlife. The series, which left many viewers in floods of tears, follows widowed reporter Tony, Gervais, as he grieves the loss of his wife Lisa, Carrie God Lyman. Initially overwhelmed by the anger he feels at the world, Tony eventually finds meaning in helping others, despite his pain. According to Ricky, the premise of the show was based on his own relationship with Jane, and has previously admitted that he hopes she outlives him. Speaking to Alex Jones on BBC One's The One Show, Ricky revealed, The first thought I had was what if you lost everything? You could do what you want and it would have no consequences. I had to think, well what is losing everything? And to me it's your soulmate, your life partner. So that's where it came from. How did Ricky Gervais meet Jane Fallon? Reading Born Ricky, 62, first met author Jane, also 62, more than 40 years ago, back when they were students at University College London. Soon after graduation, Jane landed a job as a producer on BBC's EastEnders from 1985 to 1994 while Ricky's start in television came later following a brief stint managing the pop band Suede. In the early days of their relationship, the couple lived in a flat in King's Cross at a time when the area was notorious for its street crime and drug dealers. Are Ricky Gervais and Jane Fallon married? Despite the length of their romance, both Ricky and Jane have always asserted that they will never get married with staunch atheist Ricky arguing that he doesn't feel the need to tie the knot. Ricky revealed to the Times, We are married for all intents and purposes, everything's shared and actually our fake marriage has lasted longer than a real one. But there's no point in us having an actual ceremony before the eyes of God because there is no God. Similarly, the duo have also ruled out children in their lives. The comedian explained the decision to the Daily Telegraph, One good reason I don't want, kids, is that I don't think kids sleep at night. He further explained, I had to check twice that I hadn't left the doors to the pool open because I was worried the cat would go through them and drown. So with a child, it just be stood over it, making sure it was still breathing. Back in 2019, Ricky confessed that he couldn't live without Jane and that would be devastated if they weren't together. During an interview on the Live with Kelly and Ryan show, he said, I would fall apart without her. I mean, emotionally first. Later, he also shared that he hoped to die before Jane, stating, I want to go first, which is selfish but I do. Do you have a story to share? Email us at julia.banim at reachbook.com.